Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you are new. My name is Jenna and I am just outside enjoying this beautiful day. It has been so nice the last two, three days here in Ohio. It is 73 degrees currently, which is amazing because on Monday, Tuesday, it was raining and snowing. <laughs> Ohio is insane, but I am just enjoying this beautiful su Sunday morning. Sunday, it's not Saturday, Jenna. Sunday morning with my kids outside. Zach is currently detailing another person's vehicle right now. And it's just going to be a nice, chill Sunday. I do have a few things that I need to get done, so I will go ahead and bring you along for the day. <laughs> Wake up at mine Same question always I'm getting tired We could have breakfast Got in your freckles Close to the west coast How about that? Why don't we just get a place together? Mornings in our own bed So much better Balconies and bathtubs What you want Why don't we just get So Maverick is napping, Navy is right here napping, and as you guys just saw, I went out in the garage because I knew I had more bibs and birth rags and also um, car seat canopy covers and stuff for Navy because they were Savannah's. So I knew that I had some, and I did, I found them. I'm gonna hurry up and throw them in the washing machine because I just started that. But I've got this burp cloth that was Savannah's, this one, got a bunch. I've got this one. Voila. And then I wish I would have used these for Maverick. Like these are, those would have been great. Got this. And I've got a green one. And lastly, a gray one. So again, I'm so mad that I didn't like look for these two years ago when Maverick was a baby. And car seat covers. So I got these for free a couple of years ago. They're from Car Seat Canopy. So I've got this one. And then the one that I usually have is like a gray Aztec print. This light gray one, and these are also great as nursing covers because they're not super tight and they have you know, a hole at the top and a hole at the bottom. That's also why I really needed these. And last but not least, this pink one. I've got some more girly ones. And then I have so many bibs, which this is what I'm excited for because these bibs I got at Toys R Us before Toys R Us closed around us back in 2017. Yes, that was when I was pregnant with Savannah. And they were super cheap. And so the ones that I have out for her are um, white, blue, and gray, which I use those for Maverick because when Savannah was a baby, I just bought 
the two packs that were left, which was boy and girl, and I didn't really care. But I just need some more because she spits up quite a bit and the Velcro is kind of garbage, you know. You get to the third kid, it kind of happens. So I've got some pink, 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 purple, some more purples. Like I have a whole bunch and I'm so happy. More pinks, whatever, coral, this is coral. And then another pink. So I'm gonna go ahead and throw all of these in the washing machine with the rest of the kids' clothes. So that way they are good to go. Like I found so much stuff that was Savannah's. I am so happy. One thing I will say that really stinks um, is the fact that Navy does share a room with us for now until she's older to share with Savannah. So she doesn't have her own closet. The reason why this really stinks is because I don't have a place to hang up her clothes. Like I have like a small area, but Navy is really in between sizes and I can't have so many sizes out. So I feel like I'm wasting so much time constantly going through clothes to find that fit her. And I really wanna find like a little rack that has wheels and stuff that I can hang up all of her stuff on. Or I think I might go upstairs, clean out a section in my closet because I have so many clothes that I don't even fit me in. Even when they do fit me because this is gonna be in a different video. You guys will see this in the future <laughs> of the whole fitness thing. I really, really want to clear out a spot in my closet for her so she has a spot in there because we do have a huge walk-in closet. So I feel like if I can get some section in there, put her stuff, it's gonna be better. Or I might look on Amazon, like I said, for a little rack. I don't know. I just, I really, I wanna hang up her clothes so bad. Like I have her onesies and pants and sleepers in a drawer, which is fine, but it's the other stuff that I need to see because I can't roll it up because I don't know if it's like a dress or anything. And it just, you get it. If you're a mom or just, if you're a person, you get it. You definitely get it. So I'm going to go ahead, throw this stuff in the washing machine real quick. I forgot to mention that Zach is now done with his detail and him and Savannah went to my grandma's house to go pressure wash, power wash, whatever term you want to call it, her back deck. So I am home with the two littles. I'm going to try to get some stuff done before Navy wakes up for me to nurse her again. Hence why I really wanted to go out and do that. Uh, there's some things that like my bedroom really needs a dedicated like two, three hours for me to put laundry away again, organize it, do all that. But it's just so nice out. I don't want to do that, but this is the time to do it. We'll see if it happens, but I really need to clean my downstairs area. So I guess we're really getting it done on this beautiful Sunday afternoon. I just wanna hold you. I just wanna look into your eyes and tell you that I want you. You know you make me feel so alive. Can't stop thinking about you day and night. Love it when you kiss me, love it when we touch. Every time I'm down, yeah, you make me smile. You're the solution. Show you guys me fully cleaning my house just because this isn't a clean video but i got my living room picked up which you guys saw i will fold that laundry that's more kids laundry i'm gonna wait till that load's done combine it all together it'll be one big load and i can just fold everything at the same time i've got my table all cleaned up i've got my counters all cleaned off that's just electronics charging over there got my clean dishes unloaded put the dirty dishes in the sink, into the dishwasher. Got this all clean over here. This is the air fryer for the camper. We used it last night for our cookout. So we need to go clean it and put it back into the camper. And now it is time for me to change Navy Girl and have some one-on-one -on -one time together. I can fly. about you day and night. I love it when you kiss me. love it when we touch. Every time I'm down, yeah, you make me smile. You're the okay i did end up ordering a rack on amazon i'll go ahead and like put it on the side here what i ordered it is coming tomorrow and i got it on sale also and all of the reviews are really good it has an average of four star reviews with over nine thousand reviews so i think that's 
you know, pretty good. Uh, I am really excited for it. I think it's going to be perfect. It's got two racks, which will be perfect for all of Navy's clothes. And I'm just so excited. I really think it's going to be a game changer. I'm going to feel much better about it. I can have all of her clothes there because I feel like she's not getting to wear other things because I'm... I guess lazy or like I just can't find them because it's not organized and like there's just a lot of elements playing into that so I really think that this rack is going to help a lot I'm very excited for it I want to tell you guys about this new laundry hamper that I got from LifeWit I am obsessed with it. It is so nice. It is super cute. I love the handles. It's lightweight and perfect to carry up and down the steps. So I will go ahead and leave that link in the description for you guys. And thank you so much, LifeWit, for sending me this laundry hamper. I had to put this on wide lens mode just in order for you guys to see his entire room. So as you see, we got his mattress. We have like an old mattress we're going to put underneath it and put a cover on it so it's not like flat, flat on the ground. Just because I think that's going to be too high off the ground for him. We will have to keep the crib in here. We need to put furniture straps on the back of that, but I want to see if the mattress fits first. Then we're going to have to move the camera. We've got a lot we got to do in order to get him ready for his big boy bed tonight. Maverick loves his bed. Mavi, do you love your bed? Yeah. Yeah, it's so cute. I know, it's so cute. You have your own room in your new bed, your bunk bed. I got all of this bedding at Kohl's. I ordered this online because I didn't have it in the store. And his comforter and sheets and everything I got at Kohl's. Oh my gosh, my baby boy is in a big boy bed. I can't. It's just so crazy. We do still have the crib in here just in case, you know, he's up for a couple hours and we need him to get some sleep. We can put him in there, but this will soon be moved out and put into our room, which is so crazy. <laughs> Here is Maverick's room, you guys. Remember the crib is going to be coming out soon once he gets adjusted to his bed. Obviously, Zach is not gonna be in here. <laughs> uh, I'm just really happy with it. We got the camera up there so then we can see the entire room to keep an eye on him. All outlets are covered. The bookcase is right there covering that one. We'll have to figure out what we're gonna do with the fan situation because he does sleep with a fan. So we might have to put something else in front of that. So then the one outlet's covered and then the plug. Plus we can see him up in the camera as well. But I'm just really happy with how everything turned out. The only thing I didn't think through is his bedding doesn't really match his blue rug. But you know, you live and you learn, just kind of how it is. But I'm really happy with this room. Need to touch up a few things. Other than that, I can't believe my baby boy is gonna be in a big boy bed. Mm -hmm. 
All right, you guys, and that is going to be it for today's video. I really hope that you enjoyed this productive, beautiful Sunday day in the life with me. <laughs> that was a mouthful, but I hope you enjoyed this. And if you did, please make sure to hit the thumbs up button, subscribe if you wanna see more, and I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye. What if the world had more of your smile? What if the wind could